It was an easy border crossing from Belize into Guatemala and we made our way to the Jaguar Inn in Tikal National Park. We found a guide named Henry who agreed to meet us bright and early the next morning to give us the tour of the famous Mayan ruins. You need a full day or maybe a little bit of the next day. So we are exactly here. We're going to take this way to connect with the Twin Pyramid. Okay, but the function of these stilas was just to represent the portrait of the king. From here to the top, you know, yeah. completely covered with a lot of um, scarlet maca or quetzal feathers. Exact same amount of importance because you need sun and rain. You need water and sun to grow crops. Exactly, you're right. When it's a uh, when it's a uh, burning, oof, it's a uh, it's very sticky. So don't touch. <laughs> yeah, don't get your nose on it. We are in Tikal at the top of Star Wars Rebel Base, Yavin 4, um, and we're just staying, seeing the jungle and all the rest of the pyramids. Tikal means place of echoes or place of voices. We're hearing howler monkeys, we saw spider monkeys, lots of birds. It's just a perfect day. We just passed through um, the ball courts. Every 52 years, there are teams playing in each three. And there are six captains. So each captain gets sacrificed. And they go and put offerings in each one. And the king goes up there. And, and then the captains get sacrificed they cut off their heads. Yeah. Normally, they capture the king and then they carry it to the city. They prepare him, they numb the body, they tie you know, and then they did the human sacrifice to commemorate the victory. The town of Flores is a small island on Lake Piten Itza and is a short hour's drive from Tikal. The roads are tight, the buildings are colorful, and we found a great hostel with space for us to relax, get some work done, and pet bunnies. We stayed for three days and enjoyed the sight and great food. We are eating at a taco stand at the center of the island Flores. I just got this really yummy torta. Uh, torta is like um, like a sandwich, but with like soft bread, and it, it has pickles and like tomatoes and ranch sauce. It's really good. I am eating a Mexican taco from um, Street Vendor. Got something called a Combo One, which comes with a burrito, a Mexican taco a torta and a liquido, which is basically like a smoothie. Four dollars. What are, we, what are we doing? We're riding on this little car tiny, tiny, tiny ferry. Car ferry. And when we put our our route in Google, what did we notice this morning? I said the, the drive is going to be like six and a half hours. But For how many kilometers? It's like 300 kilometers. So we drove the first 80% of the route on asphalt at high speed and it was fine. And then it was like 50 kilometers left three hours. We said, what could possibly take three hours for 50 kilometers? And then we turn up off the asphalt and we're going up these switchbacks on a really terrible gravel road. 
and it's beautiful because we're up in the clouds in the rainforest, but we're having to take it really slowly because we don't want to get a flat up here. The long, difficult drive led us to a place that was bathed in peace and serenity. We stayed for two restful nights at the Utopia Eco Hotel. We are at the Utopia Eco Hotel and we are in this little cabin. Um, around us is jungle. This morning we, we did some yoga. We just had breakfast and we're packing up to leave. We tried some morning yoga and soaked up all the awesome hospitality. And there was lots of four-legged friends to love as well. Samuk Champay is a natural monument consisting of cascading pools of beautiful blue water. It was super quiet and we loved swimming in the peaceful pools. We went to this like pool, it's like a bunch of like layers of pools that have like little like water slides. It's like rocks with like water flowing down them that like they like fall into the other pool and it's really cool. We drove uh, like 45 minutes to a site where we put on like life jackets, then we hopped in two and went down rapids. There were six rapids, three and four were like the most like... Um, we're getting ready to go tubing down rapids. What do you think so far? Cold? Cold. <laughs> Feel on your butt. <laughs> Funny story, um, mommy and daddy, they on rapid four, they flip. Alright, these are going to be the biggest rapids, or so they say. Everyone was leaning to avoid one big wave, and then, and then it's like, jumped and flipped over. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> After so much natural beauty, it was time to head south to explore the city of Antigua where we planned to stay for a whole month. Playing with the dogs at Utopia. Learning about Mayan history at Tikal. I love tubing on the rapids. Relaxing in the jungle at Utopia Lodge. I really enjoyed exploring the streets of Flores. 